guys, welcome back to my channel. So obviously no makeup sitting on my bedroom floor because apparently this is mom life, right? <laughs> you sneak in video sessions when you can. But I just checked the mail and I got this really exciting box from Look Fantastic. I've talked to you guys about them before. They are a monthly subscription box, so they have beauty products in here, hair care, skin care, makeup, things like that. This is a special one, so you can tell the box is a little bit bigger than it typically is. So there's eight products in here instead of their typical like five or six that they usually have. And these are editor pick uh, products. So their editors went through, picked their favorite beauty products, put together a limited edition box. So I thought we can open this up together, share it with you guys, and then while I'm doing that, I will do a face mask because why not, right? So this is from, this has nothing to do with Look Fantastic, by the way, I just figured I'd do a face mask while I was filming. This one's from Dermalogica. This is their Hydro Mask Exfoliant. So this is a hydrating and an exfoliating mask all in one. The packaging is really cool. I don't use it as much as I should. I mean, I've used a good amount of it. It's down to right here. I used to be really into face masks, like at the start of the pandemic, I feel like I was doing face masks all the time and then I just stopped and I just feel like I need to get back on that whole thing because it really does make a difference in your like your skin overall and do you guys notice a difference in your skin when you do face masks I mean I definitely notice like more plump clearer skin you know less I don't really get acne but less discoloration and unevenness and I do get milia bumps occasionally and a couple of those have popped up recently so this should help with that this is supposed to uh, it says hydrating and exfoliating mask smooths and renews for luminous healthy looking skin so I'm using the viewfinder as my mirror by the way which is why I'm looking over there not at you guys okay guys let's open this baby up this is the best of clean beauty collection with innovative skin and hair care essentials limited edition box, yada yada, eight of our beauty editor's favorite products we know you'll love. By the way, if you've never heard of Look Fantastic before, I will link their website down below. This time they actually did give me a discount code. I think it's 22% off. All right, here's what it's filled with. Let's dig on in. Okay, I'm gonna pick the biggest product first because it's just what's exciting to me. So looks like this. It is the Daily Detox Massaging Brush. I'm hoping this is for your body, not your face, because it is huge. It's a dry brush. You know, I've heard a lot about dry brushing lately. It's supposed to help with like your circulation and your body and of course exfoliating and things like that. I am definitely gonna try this. I've been very interested because like I said, I've heard a lot of people talk about it lately. Breaks up cellulite deposits, removes dry skin, in, yada 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 you do it before you shower and then after you get out of your shower you apply moisturizer and all that good stuff okay next thing in here is a hair care product by alterna this is their caviar anti-aging clinical defying foam conditioner you know what's so funny i was just at tj maxx today and i saw amika has a foam conditioner that i was like this close to buying but i didn't get it so this is kind of the same concept my mom really likes this caviar line I wonder if she's used this before. It just says it's supposed to moisturize and hydrate the hair for fuller and softer results. So I guess it's just a conditioner. It'd be nice if they would have given you the shampoo to go with the conditioner. Okay, next thing in the box is by the brand Verso, I believe. It's their micellar water. I do really like micellar waters. This is a cute little, um, just like a little one. <laughs> That'd be nice to travel with. It's a cleansing water pretty much. So if you wash your face, but you feel like you still have some residue, like makeup residue or just oily skin then you put it on a cotton pad and kind of wipe it off or you can use this as your makeup remover okay next thing in here is by the brand Corez and it's their foaming cream cleanser Greek yogurt okay you know I feel like I've tried stuff from Corez on and off not recently I haven't tried much but the fact that this has Greek yogurt in it it's just intriguing to me it's a foam a cream to foam cleanser so I bet it'll like foam up on the Clarisonic really well. Soothing, cooling, nourishing, all that good stuff. So far, I have never tried any of these products before, so that's really exciting. Next thing in here is from the brand The Organic Pharmacy. It's their lip and eye cream. It's interesting, lip and eye cream. I would never think to put my eye cream on my lips or vice versa. I feel like those are two very distinctly different products so the fact that this is both like that is intriguing to me let's see 
Ultra Rich and Nourishing Cream provides a soothing treatment to the delicate eye and lip areas. It's a balmy texture. I would be hesitant, I'm gonna be honest, to try something like this. Gosh, it's expensive. It retails for $49. I would use it as a lip product for sure, but the fact that you can also use it on your eyes, interesting. The next one in here is by the brand Cryori Skincare. I, I can't say I've even, even heard of this brand before, so this is their hand and body replenisher. So that sounds maybe like a moisturizer. It provides your skin with a customized treatment that gently exfoliates, moisturizes, and provides essential anti antioxidants for softer, smoother skin. Oh, it helps with stretch marks, breakouts, pigmentation, dry skin, and more. It sounds like it's just kind of like a multi-purpose product. It says apply liberally all over body. Ooh, you can apply post hair removal to prevent ingrown hairs. I feel like this is just like, it does everything. Um, interesting. I guess that's probably why it's an editor favorite. Multi-purpose products are really nice. And in fact, I'm kind of noticing that trend in here. Multi-purpose products. You got the eye and lip. You got this one. My cellar water can be multi-purpose. I'm just really curious about this. I Something that claims to do so much, like does it really do all of that? It smells. Not bad, but it, it does have a scent to it. Next thing in here is by Juice Beauty. I have definitely heard of Juice Beauty before. So this is their Bamboo Pore Refining Mask. Oh, I should have used this instead of the Dermalogic. I didn't know. So this is $10 for this little 0.5 fluid ounce. It protects against mask knee. <laughs> I've never heard of that term before. I guess that's mask acne or acne caused by wearing masks. I guess that's a thing now, pandemic, right? It hydrates, it exfoliates, it soothes, all that good stuff. Okay, last thing in here, oh my gosh, this retails for $48. This is by the brand Arella, Ariella, I, I'm not sure how to say that. I've never heard of it before. It's their probiotic skincare cell uh, revitalized night moisturizer. So this is a little, this little tiny one fluid ounce retails for $48. It better be magical. It says it's a night cream. It has probiotic ingredients. It just says that it protects, restores balance to the skin, has a calming nature to it. Wow. Okay. It's just so tiny. Like I'm blown away by how expensive that is. Glass bottle. Very interesting. Feels nice. I will have to try this out and see if I think it's worth $48. It seems really thick, which is good for a night cream. Well, the value of this box is $150, but you can get it for $40, and then if you use my link, you get 22% off. This is a pretty cool box. I mean, if you wanna try some cool new things and all of that. So I actually think I'm going to take my mask off and then put this fancy night cream. I know it's not nighttime right now, but I just, I'm really very curious about it. Okay, fancy night cream, let's, Let's see what you're all about here. See if it immediately does anything weird to my skin. I can't tell if I like the scent or not. Like it smells good, but okay, my skin feels okay, which is good. And then I think just for the heck of it, I'm gonna use this like eye and lip thing just for my lips. I don't wanna put it on my eyes. I have eye cream on, so. It's a cream base. It's weird for your lips, right? Okay, let's see. Yeah, um, hmm. <laughs> I feel like you're not supposed to put it on your lips, but it clearly says lip and eye cream. Um, okay. Anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed watching me unbox this and my fun little try on part of the video. But um, yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.